All-Star Game Week is here, and Major League Baseball is about to open Play Ball Park at the Convention Center downtown. Yeah, it's interactive fun for baseball lovers. Our Sean Chin is do, takes us there tonight to give us all a preview to the event. It opens tomorrow, and Sean, the best part is you don't have to pay anything to get in. Yeah, Jim and Karen, that is amazing that they're going to have this great fan experience for free and clearly a lot of excitement already there. 100,000 tickets already given away and the team from the MLB that was here giving us a tour today says this is unlike any fan experience they've ever offered before. Playball Park promises to be the ultimate fan experience. With three indoor diamonds, baseball lovers will not only get to learn the history of this sport, but work on their skills, whether they are pitching or batting. They taught me how to hold the bat, um, get posi good position on the bat. Robert Hunter was one of many kids from the Boys and Girls Club helping test out all the interactive experiences inside the convention center, where there is something for all ages and all heights. You can learn about the contributions of women and the Negro League, even see the world's largest baseball. While Hunter was here, he got tips from some of the best outside in the batting cage. How you grab a bat, uh, how you stride through, through the ball, and um, just the, the basics for, um, for hitting. Former Rockies all-star player Vinny Castilla spent time with the kids before Play Ball Park opens to the public. I think it's great. I think it's great to keep promoting the game. M MLB is doing a great job to promoting the game, and uh, especially with the, with the young kids. Visitors will also get to see trophies and can sign up to get autographs. The MLB expects the average guest will want four hours to get through all the activities. Yeah, I think they should try it out because it's fun, good competition. Uh, you could do it with your friends and family. So those advanced tickets have all been taken, but there is still a way for you to be able to come down here each day. You're going to want to go online, look up and see what time slots work best for you. Right now on CBSDenver.com, we have a link to the site you will need to go to each day so you can be part of the fun here at Playball Park. Live tonight in downtown Denver, Sean Chitness covering Colorado First. Looks like fun, Sean. The All-Star Game bringing all kinds of family-friendly events, and we're making it easy to keep track of it ev everything. Just scan the QR code on the screen right now to download the CBS Denver app. We will be sending alerts out every day with a guide to that day's fun.